Where were you when you found out you passed the CP exam? Was there anyone in the room and did you scare anyone? <laughs> what, what was that experience like? So with each of the tests, I, I work from home. I'm, I'm here at my desk all the time. So I, I, you know, was regularly checking the scores, especially when the eyeball trick still worked um, the night before. And um, so my family was always here and I, I got to, you know, <clears throat> the first score came back in 96 and that was really mind blowing to me that that level was actually achievable because I was aiming for Elijah Watzell's just to ensure that I passed. And so I, like, I, my, I caught my breath like, oh, wow. It's possible. <laughs> so it is possible. Yeah. Um, the last one was the funniest one though, because I, I felt really good about it. I got out into just under two and a half hours and I thought, okay, I feel like I nailed this. I don't know if I got the score I needed to get Elijah Watt cells, but it was, it was, you know, it was good. It turned out to be my highest. It was a 97. I got it first thing in the morning when I got up to work. And by the time my brother came downstairs, I was so flashed forward into what the AICPA's ethics course required and what Utah's uh, State Board of Accountancy <laughs> required that my brother came down and was like, Did you pass? Well, and I'm like, oh, it was a 97. <laughs> He's like, how did you forget already? <laughs> and it was, so it was, it was funny. But yeah, each of my scores, um, I screamed it through the house. Oh my gosh, I passed. You know, I got a 90 something or whatever, you know. And so that was, it was a really great experience. But yeah, it wasn't, I don't have any funny work stories with, being in the office with other people. <laughs> oh, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, it's still incredible. So unfortunately you, you didn't quite hit Elijah Watts cells. And yeah, I came out with 95.25 and they require uh, over 95.5. Oh, so, my goodness. I thought yeah. it was 95. I didn't realize it was 95.5. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> That's okay. what they say anyways on the website. So that was a bummer. <laughs> uh, okay. yeah. Well, maybe I can, maybe I can put a good word in for <laughs> That's you. right. That's I'll right. see what I can do. <laughs> Yeah, it's so that, that wow, that is amazing. So in 97, 96, and um, I know what you guys, um, was it 92 on audit? 92 okay. on odd, yeah. Okay. Car and BEC were both 96, and then reg was 97. Wow, that is incredible. So, Oops. so yeah, so I, I, the folks listening, I'm sure they'd love to know what was your process, what you know, what was your routine that you got into. Sure. Um, how, how many hours per week do you work? How many hours per week were you studying? <laughs> uh, how much, how much time did you give yourself to say, we, we'd love to know all the nitty gritty details if you, if you're willing to share. I'm more than happy to. Yeah. Um, so I signed up for Wiley just after finishing a second bachelor and, and the one semester of master's courses, because that was what was required. Okay. I didn't have an accounting degree. I had a business administration degree. Okay. But I loved accounting when I got that in the early 2000s. <clears throat> so I'd always wanted to go back. But in order to take the master's program I wanted online with WGU out here, I had to do their accounting undergrad. So they transferred more than half my credits. I spent a couple of semesters doing that. So I was just coming off of school. So I had the study routine and the schedule and everything um, all put together. I was really grateful for your program with your your just all of the different things you put together to help people understand how important it is to study and to schedule and to be consistent and to review and repeat. Um, that really helped me get over a lot of my fear of moving from standard college to CPA prep because I knew it was going to be a beast compared to what I've been doing. Sure. But so I work a full-time job and I also work a couple of side jobs. They're all for the same owner. Okay. But, um, so I have my full-time job that I work, uh, nine to five Eastern. I'm in mountain time. So it's seven to three, my time. And then I, I work again from like three 30, my time. So five 30 Eastern until about seven 30, eight o'clock, right before I go to bed. And when I wasn't in school, that would be my work schedule. So I, I'm putting in roughly 12 to 13 hours per day, Monday through Friday, and then about eight to 10 on Saturdays. So what I would do, uh, my boss, who's a CPA, would allow me off of my side jobs. I still had to keep my full-time job and just do a little bit for him here and there as needed, but then I would study. So I was, I was studying, I mean, if you figure I'm putting in 40 hours a week of work and then another four to five every evening, Monday through Friday, and another probably six to eight on the weekends. Sure. And that's what, 10, 20, 28 roughly hours of study per week. Yeah. Yeah, and, that, and, and it was grueling. 
<laughs> it, it is, yeah, it's mind numbing for sure. <laughs> so it sounds like you use uh, Wiley CPA Excel and, or Wiley CPA as they call themselves now. Mm -hmm. um, and so we, I actually have a bundle with Wiley CPA that yes. includes um, both their platinum course plus my mentorship program and tutoring and all that. Um, so, so yeah, so the whole goal with, with that is that with having a mentor, a lot of the folks listening, you're probably fresh out of college, or you could be more of a non-traditional CPA candidate. So maybe you've okay. been, been working for a long time and, and you're scared to get back into the study process. So the, the value of having somebody like me, who's gone through the experience, I've, I work with over 2000 CPA candidates since 2015, I'll teach you step-by-step -step how to use Wiley. Did you, did you use my Wiley tutorial? That was my saving grace. Good. Your tutorial taught me more about how to use the Wiley software than the Wiley software did. I like all of their intro videos and stuff. And I was like, okay, I kind of feel like I get it. And then I watched yours and I was like, oh, oh, yeah. this is how that works. This is how I, and I understood completely all the stuff that was available to me, what I could look for, all the different supports there. So it was tremendous. Just yeah. absolutely fantastic. Yeah. The, the Wiley software, it's very overwhelming and, <laughs> and, and, and I've, I'm still learning stuff about it from, from the Wiley users, like just finding how to get from one place to another, how to connect the, the source material to the questions and all that stuff. Hey, future CPA. Thanks so much for checking out this clip of the CPA exam guide podcast. You can find the full episode link below in the video description, but while you're down there, please also check out Kessler CPA review. So this is my study supplement that it combines confidence building mentorship, score boosting study supplements and time saving tutoring and fun to ensure that you succeed. So all you have to do is use the links down in the video description or in the comments section to find out more. And so ultimate CPA exam guide, this is going to be uh, Kessler CPA mentorship. So we're going to teach you step by step how to pass a CPA exam, how to use your CPA review course, and then integrate it with our Kessler CPA study supplements. And so here's a little preview of the study supplements that we have. So we've got some Kessler cues for you. We've got some Kessler cards. You can even create your own flashcards. So here's the front and the back. We've got full mock exams, uh, full practice uh, questions with um, detailed analytics. Um, everything is mapped to the AICPA blueprints and updated for the most recent exam um, uh, that you'll actually see. Lots of reporting and uh, basically it's the perfect study supplement to teach you from questions you've never seen before. So these are professor made questions that no one else in the industry is using and they're going to teach you the blueprints from the ground up. And again, we also have video tutoring. So all you have to do is submit your questions here and within 72 hours or less, a tutor will create a unique video lecture teaching you the particular concept that you have a question on. And again, this is one on one. You're going to receive an email with a link to a video from a tutor, and they're going to give you that aha moment and allow you to outsource your research to my team so that you can do more important things like studying or even having fun and hanging out with your family while studying for the CPA exam. So I hope you can check it out. Everything is in the video description and I'll catch up with you in the next video.